Okay, Chris, how do you want to take us away then? Yeah, right. Um, first of all, it's episodes 77 to night. Can we believe it? I know. So, we've got the daily check in. We've got the basketball skills with the one of the only Peugeot Santos. Oh, I think it's Brandon. Brandon. With the Dan, one with Brandon. Fitness with D. Zoom games with the gorgeous Teresa. Thank you. And I, and I know Nick's not, not here, but yeah. I've got his sing along choice that, that he sent me. And we've got. Painted with the lovely, the gorgeous Serena. Yeah, lovely. Thank you, Chris O. Fantastic. Right, let us start then with the daily check in. I mean, it is interesting, isn't it? We are getting nothing less and less on yeah. as life is sort of starting to get. What back. do you mean? Hi, Brandon. So yeah. let's have a look how everybody's day has been. So, should we do, um, let's do a, a thumbs up. For a good day, yeah. and a thumbs down. Okay, so let's have a look. Yeah, it's fine. Right, can I see a thumb? Yeah, oh, Fred, that's a good one. Andrew's had a good one. Lenora's got a lovely Robin in the background. She's had a good one. Well, let's go to Andrew first. Who's yeah. had a Day. So, Andrew, why have you had such a good day? Um, I've been outside. Yeah. Again, gardening. Gardening, lovely. And I'm going to fitness with Brandon and I. Oh, you did your fitness with Brandon, fantastic. Did you help him lead that, Andrew, as well? Yeah, I did, yes. We oh. did. Brilliant. Mm. Up for that. So well, so well. And, and, yeah, Chris, as well. and Chris as well. Well done, Chris. Yeah, you make a good team, you guys, with that. That's brilliant. Yeah. Right, let us go to Fran, because Fran, you've not had such a good day, so do you want to tell us why you've not had such yeah. a good day? To be honest, I'm, I'm still in my food shopping this morning at half five, but I just didn't want to go because of um, the commitments, which, Chris, you know about, don't you, Carol yeah, yeah. So, because of that, I was really upset and changed my oh. mind, etc. Right. I'm going tomorrow at half five. Yeah. So you've solved it. You've solved it. What was, yeah. Oh, bless yeah. you. Well, you know, we are always sending you love. From Thank you. And I've let someone else go my slot. Oh, good girl. We're going to have three of us. Ah. Uh, okay. we, we've, we've been running for, we ran for it yesterday. Um, in, in the days of um, Ballside, the program, they, yes. they was raised money for charity. You had to get, Three hundred and one in nine darts. I remember uh, it. We will not get anywhere near three hundred and one <laughs> because we're well out of practice. Well, I'm out of practice. Uh, with, with our trial games, Susie and Jacob came out top. So, <laughs> um, oh, brilliant. Uh, so we do it in three rounds, three darts in each in each round. Yeah. So the three rounds adds up to nine darts. So you'll have uh, individual rounds with Susie, okay. myself, and Jacob. And then there'll be a total of the nine darts to see who's got the highest number. Oh, fantastic. Oh, that sounds really good. Yeah, so we've got to work out exactly uh, what day that's going to be this week. And moved, the winner has uh, to pay a charity a thousand pounds. To Thursday. So it might not be Thursday, oh, but I will <laughs> confirm with you what day. Yeah. Right, fabulous. So, Brandon, are you now ready with bat and ball skills? Yes, yes, 100%. Marvellous, right. So, yeah. am I, I'm going to spotlight you, Brandon. Oh, I feel special now. <laughs> yeah, there we go. There we go. You're spotlighted. <laughs> Sorry, let me just move by and bid on this. <laughs> uh, good, uh, good afternoon, everyone, again. Um, so, today, um, yeah, it's been quite a hard one to think of something that we haven't done, but I think we've already done this one. But what's going to happen today is we're going to be basically bouncing the ball with our back, just normally. And after a while, I went to try and hit in the air, depending on how high your ceiling is, and try and catch it either in a pocket you've got in your shorts, uh -huh. trousers, t-shirt, or if you don't have any pockets, you can try and catch it with t-shirts, 
or anything or anything you can try and catch with your back of your head. Just try and make it creative. And we're trying to see who's the most creative person here. So the more creative you are, the, the better the challenge will be, okay? So try something creative, you know. Do that a was first, Brandon. Let's see. Oh, cool. I caught it. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. That was good. Do the so, T-shirt yeah, you know, Catch your T-shirt. Yeah, that's an easy one, the T-shirt. Or try and catch it in your pocket. Oh, Pippa. Is that X-rated? <laughs> Pippa just caught it down her cleavage. Excellent, I love it. It is, is something, it's creative, it's something, I can't disagree. At least she's catching it with something. I'm gonna catch it in my hair. Come on Chris, try and catch it with your t-shirt. Bounce the ball Chris and try and catch it with your t-shirt like this. Come on Chris, show me up. Come on Andrew. Come on, won't we? I wonder if I could catch it on my glasses. If you could try and catch it with your glasses, you know. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Good catch, Chris. Most creative. <laughs> oh, she's got the Pringles tube now. Oh, like. oh, Helen's trying to catch you with her cup. Nearly got it with her cup. Yeah. Cup. I'm going to try to oh. say. Lenora, don't poke your eye out. I hope you're okay. Oh, I love uh, it. Susie caught, caught in her shoe. Yeah. Susie in her shoe. Chris, what are you doing? Let's have a look, Chris. Yes, yeah, Chris. I love it. Let's have a look, Lucy. Let's have a look, Harry Potter. What are you going to do, Harry Potter? Yeah, Lucy's cat looks like she's going to cat. Good, Jake. Let's have a look, Jacob. Go on. Good catch. Let's see how look. What are you going to do, Jacob? What are you going to do? Are you going to catch it? You're going to catch your t-shirt, your shorts. Oh, yeah. it's coming. Oh, what are you going to do? Oh, I like it. And do you want to catch? You can try and uh, catch it. <laughs> you know, instead of you getting up, just try this and just hit it through the hole. <laughs> What's Jacob doing? Oh, yeah, try and catch it with a spoon. In the pocket, nearly. Oh, I yes, like you. Good. This is a great one, Brandon. Love it. So Thank you. And that was great. Um, uh, bat and ball skills really lovely now a few reminders before we go on to lenora is don't forget a uh, radio show uh, tomorrow franz just remind me is musicals so get your requests in don't forget as well it's photo competition tomorrow um so get those in by two o'clock to nikki and alexis and that's on landscapes do not forget of course that it's franz birthday on sunday and um if you do want franz address then let us know um, you could always put it in the chat again if you wanted to, Fran, but I know I noted it down the other day. Um, and, and, and your quiz is going to be on Thursday now instead. Yep, that's brilliant. So now we go on to, we haven't got Dee. Tim, I didn't tell you, Dee's gone off to do a um, house viewing, so bless her. Oh, nice. So she is um, kindly letting me know, and Lenora has stepped in last moment, is going to give us a lovely flute um, oh, nice. Rendition, Perfect. which we've not had for ages. So I'm just Lenora going to. Uh, oh, you've unmuted. Wonderful. Hello. Uh, have you seen a robin? Um, <laughs> this one uh, um, is partly my composition. It's, it's rocking Piper, Piper rocking, rocking Piper. And think of rocking Robin. <laughs> um, so, oh, here we go. Now, of course, I use back in track, so look at that one second. Thank you. 
Summery and sort of oh, uh, yeah, put I, me in the mood. I need I, a gin and tonic now. Strip, strip off, not, not literally, you know, like strip off the uh, inhibition. Lenora, Lenora, I just did some, well, Teresa actually did this brilliant presentation to about 50 other local and we played, it was, um, and us, we were asked to eat uh, a bit, and you know what really stood out about Lenora's bit was, this was, must have been quite early on in the Daily Show, there was no virtual background, it was just a curtain. Yeah. I can't remember when I last saw you without a virtual background. Well, you wouldn't, you wouldn't want to see my room, would you? <laughs> No, it was, it was amazing. It was really good, really well done. You did so well. That was perfect. They loved it. Oh, no, no, thank you. Good. We got nice comments, didn't we? Yeah, I've already had a couple of people email. There's some quite good people on there. Ooh, like, what? Yeah, yeah, it was 44 people. I was trying to look at the list of who they were, but very interesting. Good, good one. Thanks very right. Much. Thank you, Lenora. Always a star. Right, let us go on to uh, my Zoom games. Now, you might have heard of the, the game Logo. So I was delving in my box under the bed. I've got all games because we're quite a games family. And I thought, oh, yeah, this would work. So um, I'm going to uh, spotlight me. OK. And hold up. Right. So this, I think, Tim, people can unmute themselves if they know the answer. Now, there's a card, but there's going to be four questions on there. OK. And I'm going to ask the questions... And if you know the answer, unmute yourself and just call it out, okay? So uh, here we go. This is all about the, the great British seaside. How many pieces of wood are used in the construction of a standard British deck chair? There's a question. Nine. Nine. Four. No, not four, a bit higher. Excellent. Nine. Excellent. Oh, you're close 21. <laughs> Ten. I was saying. I was saying. Oh, it's going to be an even number, isn't it? <laughs> no, it's not an even number, and it's very oh, close. No. 15. 11. 11. 17. 11. How weird is that? 11 pieces. So there we go. Let's have to look next time. Yeah. I said cranky. Cranky's a number. Oh, yeah. I thought it'd be okay. an even number. I said oh. I'm going to say cranky. I think what? Serena, Pepper, <laughs> should, I think Serena and Lenora should be banned from the Sing Games. <laughs> but, uh, I said they always, they always seem to win it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so out. Right, next question. What traditional uh, seaside items on. regularly feature in the press due to them fetching tens of thousands of pounds? Repeat the question. Sorry. What traditional seaside items regularly feature in the press due to them fetching tens of thousands of pounds? A rock. Stones? Postcards. No, not Punch and Judy. Oh, Beach Huts, Jacob. You oh, thank you, man. Oh, Beach Huts, Jacob. <laughs> right, I expect you all to get this. Which eight words follow? We do like to be beside the seaside. Uh, we do like to be beside the seaside. Pippa, thank you. Pippa, thank you. Pippa, thank you. 
Are we ready? Enough singing, enough singing, everybody. This is now the Right, we ready? Yeah, ready. Which colour on the London Underground map indicates the Northern Line? Black. Yeah, black. Oh, that was a lot of you. Ready? It's going to be a quick one. Which line? Which line is yellow? Metropolitan. Piccadilly. Circle. No circle. Tim said that. Yellow. Quiet in the gallery, please. Quiet in the gallery. Okay. What are there 412 of on the London Underground? Station. Stops. Oh. No. Toilets. Someone might have said it. Escalators. Escalators. Tim Wow. That's good. I had a call with Charlie Templeton and the deputy, well, someone from all sorts and she said have you seen the news there's an existing drug that doesn't need to go through all the tests and trials that and i just looked it up on bbc i just had a quick skim about an hour ago but it, it says that it really helps when people yeah. so anyway there's some positive news but what what we're going to do to cut a long story short is from next week um all of the other show, all of the other um programs are going to carry on as normal but we're going to um Cut down the daily show so it just happens at five o'clock on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Um, all of the other shows will carry on as normal. Um, we're still going to have, you know, all the existing things with Alexis, and we can still fit lots into those three well, days. Serena, we move your art, so we want your art to yeah, carry yeah. on. Yeah, all the good stuff, all the good <laughs> stuff can carry on, but it's going to be three Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and we've we worked out that if we do that, then around the end of August, at some stage, we're going to get to show 100. So this Friday is show 80. And uh, we'll, um, yeah, we'll keep it going Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Um, amazing. The content's been amazing. All, the, all of the other table tennis shows, some of the other table tennis shows, have all got a little bit narky with each other. And there's a bit yeah. of, you know, but not very, it's not always positive. And we just have, um, we just have a laugh. So thanks, everyone. Yeah, it's brilliant. And it is carrying on, but we're just, we're gradually like we did when we lost the Saturday. We're just gradually, so hopefully everybody feels, yeah, okay with that. The only reason I paint the stone white is because the colours show up brighter. So if yeah. I did a red on that, it'd be a bit dull for, for yeah. newbies. So, um... That's me. So the stone, mm -hmm. so I'm going to have a bit of white and a bit of yellow. Okay. Any water or just? Um, no water because you want it to dry. It, the reason why um, I put a little bit of uh, white with the yellow, it, it makes the colour more solid. So it's not quite as opaque. So I'm going to do that as the horizon. Oh, okay. So... Oh yeah, so you're doing that sort of bit further the up line the stone, of, um, Yeah. I've got a bit of a wonky stone, Serena. That's but... all right. Don't worry. It you, you doesn't have to even, even have to be straight. It can just be a, yeah. a sort of hilly type. Yes. Hilly type. Um, okay. Ground. See, so, I don't know how big people's stones are, but uh, no, I don't. Or how big your brush are it doesn't really take long oh that's a good one Chris <laughs> I like that okay and then I'm going to put a bit of uh, if you've got an old rag it's best to uh, mm. dry your, rinse your brush brush out in water and then thoroughly dry your once you rinse or just use another brush to do the next color the reason is mm. so that there's not too much water loaded onto your oh, brush yeah. okay. but I'm going to use another colour oh, sorry another brush 
I'm going to do a kind of a bluey. Okay. A bluey, pale blue. It's sort of almost. So I'm going to turn that round and then I'm going to sort of. Oh, I see. You're going up the back top bit. So I'm using my. Load up the brush with plenty of white and just sort of blend it in. Mm. Yeah, it's lovely. We've got Susie on here today, Lenora, Chris O, Lucy. J Jane's Joy. a new, Jane. new, new person. Yeah. Jane. Yeah. Jane, lovely to meet you. Hi, yeah. <laughs> and and Doreen. I'm up in the, yeah. the Midlands since Tamworth in Staffordshire. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Yeah, Just you're the furthest one away, I think. Yeah. Jane. So do you know Serena, Jane? Yeah, uh, my brother lives down south, um, and that's how I met Serena, a oh. uh, friend of my brother, his birthday party. So yeah. Yeah. So here, here, then with a sort, of, you might see a bit of a stripe, but you can sort of blend it by using. Oh, I see. Yeah. A, a, a slightly damp brush. So you're blending the, the blue and the yellow. Yeah, once you've got your two yeah. colours. Okay, gotcha. Yeah. How many people are doing it on paper or on stone? Um, I don't know. I'm. If you're holding, doing a stone, put your hand up. I'm stone. Yeah, ah, yeah. Oh, okay. Is. Yeah, we've all got stones. Good. As I said, mine's a bit wonky, but hey ho. I got so inspired by the stone painting. I don't think I've never done it before, but I bought the stone, uh, bought the uh, pens to do it. I bought some. Oh, art. great! Oh, good. You may need to take your background off to see Harry, to Lucy, because you're in a funny. Working <laughs> 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 too busy. Can't see you clearly. Uh, but that's all right. And whatever you hold up, we can actually there. see. Yeah. See. Well, thanks. It's it. almost gone green. Okay. So it has, yeah. but um, don't worry. Just because uh, it dries quickly, just what keep. What did you say, Susie? I said just keep you. drying your brush, and 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 make sure you don't have too much water, and just use white and yellow on its own. Yeah. Don't know why I did make it too watery because the water pens as well. <laughs> well, uh, when painting stones, you don't want to use watercolour. Acrylics are best. Watercolour doesn't take. Uh, no. no because what, when you varnish it, when you varnish it, it'll all come off. Uh, so, so, because of that stripe, I'm just going to completely dry my brush. Yeah. And then just sort of. Pen. So you've got a dry brush, mm. got your stripe, and then just mm. literally do one, one, one stripe, whoosh, to, to blend yeah, it in. Yeah, I got you. These are the pens if you can't do watercolour, because they're quite easy for people who can't do watercolour very well, which are... Oh, okay. that's okay. That's good. And they're at yeah. cash art for fourteen fifty at the moment. Which they're is cheaper than right. the shop we got it for. We can get it online if you're shielding. Yeah. Oh, excellent. All right. If you're not, if you're not happy, don't worry. If you, if you're not a bit worried about that, you can just do a solid colour by doing it all okay. blue. If you're, if you want to do that. So that's the alternative. You can just wipe off all the yellow. And if you're not happy, just um. Mm, I quite I'm, like. I'm probably not too happy. Nice. You like it. That's yeah. good. I'm probably going to load up a load of um. Well, that's lovely, White. Chris. Oh, you're sending me photos in WhatsApp. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Did you get the photo of my cat? Yeah, I think so. lots of stuff's been pinging up. But Ziggy. obviously, when I was running the show, I don't. Uh... Ziggy, uh, sitting on my table tennis bat. <laughs> <laughs> so, is this going to be the top of the stone, Serena, or the bottom? Yeah. This. this is the sky. We're all doing the sky, the sky at the moment. Yeah, I've, I, 
got rid of the dark contrast so I've just literally put a load of white on just yeah. to tone it all down yeah so it's the sky yeah with you for some reason people in Brighton like blue <laughs> Yeah, it's a bright and colour, isn't it? It is, yeah. The bright tonian colour. It is. To do with the seagulls. Yeah. What's that? <laughs> do with seagulls, blue and white. You can put seagulls no, in there. No, the you seagull don't... football team. Um, Paint it. <laughs> But uh, as you as you get used to painting stones, you get you get used to the feel of practicing yeah. how to make it all smooth. Yeah, and blending it. Mm. It's, it's more the blending, but that can be done. Um, mm. Practicing it on paper as well. Yeah. So it's therapeutic. I actually quite like painting a stone. I think it feels. I do. Not, yeah. I think the feel of it, isn't it? It's I don't like, know. Twenty-one stones now. Oh wow! Lucy's obsessed by painting stones. <laughs> Great. I'm not sure if Jane's near a beach or anything. <laughs> no, no, I've got a few in the garden. They're not quite. Oh, that's that right. They'll do. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm in oh. the, the country, as far away from. I know. We get. <laughs> <laughs> So I let that dry a bit while you're, <laughs> while you're finishing. Lovely. What colour are we going for at the bottom, Serena, just so I can get... Oh, that. right. We can either do dark or you can just... Or some, sometimes I just use dab. But we, I'll probably go for... Um, this one's actually naturally coloured pebble. Oh. So that, I didn't paint that at all. So that's just a dark. But you may want to do a sort of... Because you use the palette what you've got in your yeah in your, so what your things so you can just use it up so i'm going to just do it dark green maybe oh, okay so um yeah. so the dark so i use a bit of that and make i'll get some red introduce some red so that's quite good to make it uh give it some depth so normally we do not to mix with the green serena uh no um not not to lit mix but just at the very end i'll show you that later okay so okay so that's the sort of color i'm going for this that's that a bit like that then we can that's the sort of dark green yeah okay but you can do any color it can be autumn it can be um or, or summer so i'm just going to dab it all along yeah and and then add some yellow just to highlight it so you're dabbing rather than painting um, it. you can paint yeah. it you can dab it it's up to you there's no particular uh way of doing it splish splash splosh <laughs> we, we love that technical I, term serena i know <laughs> i thought um <laughs> Anna was going to do her stone. Oh, Anna yeah, she was at the club earlier. I wonder, yeah, she's probably got a bit tired. Yeah. yeah. And of course, Dee was going to do it. She had her stone painted yeah. and everything. Yeah. Obviously, yeah. Well, we can do it another time. House. Well, how comes first? Yeah. Oh, so I you can that. see why well, I've got it on a pot so you can go underneath it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it looks nice. But, but. If that side's dry, then you can do the underneath. And did you say Later you're dabbing another... yellow in there just to give it a bit of depth? The, the reason I'm dabbing it is to give it a bit of texture. Okay. So, so, cause, um, we want to give it some sort of character. Now I'm going to add a little bit of white in and just... So it's just having a feel of, of uh, sort of nature. Okay. Done mine. Oh, well done. Mm. I'm going to it dry. Um, that's good. Let it dry a little bit. Mm. Why people are so Louisa, doing it? it's six o'clock. I need to go because. Oh, oh, thank you, Chris. Finish your stone later and send me a photo. 
your head. Will you do that? Show us what it looks like now, Chris, quickly. Just mm. hold it up. Let's have a look how it's looking. Oh, fantastic. Oh, we've done two. Oh, Chris, you could do you could put... something on it, couldn't you, later? You can do yeah. your, your trees later. Well, have you got time later on or tomorrow? Well, yeah. really, um, well, this week might, might not be possible because we are so busy down here, so. <laughs> <laughs> Fair That's... enough. Thanks. It's all right. Don't worry. But we could we can finish it next week. You. How about you, that? Okay. So I mean, uh, That's you'd a... be a fabulous artist. Thank you, Chris. Good to see you. And I'll Painting see you away. tomorrow. And Teresa, don't forget to set the schedule for tomorrow evening. Of course, <laughs> I will. I never forget, Chris. Lovely to see you, Angela and Chris. You too. Bye. Nice evening, Chris. <laughs> How are you? Oh, he's gone now. He's gone. He's gone. Yeah, but it was lovely what he did last week. I thought he's um. Oh, he's amazing. Blind. I know. Mine went wrong. I got my. I painted my carpet. Oh, <laughs> that's all right. You got Nick, loads Nick, of paint on your carpet. Not I just scrub it. it. Took me ages to scrub it. <laughs> my hands went messy. I think it's because um my paints were dry and I was trying to make them wet. Okay. But I'm gonna buy some more from the same shop. Cat art. Yeah, even though I prefer mm. the other art shop, but this art shop's only one with it, um internet. But the Lawrence work, Lawrence the art shop, shop right is now. very good. The work Lawrence art paints, haven't they? The acrylic paints. The best paints are gold. So Serena, while we think of it, perhaps like sh w what would be better for you a Monday if we move this to a Monday next week? Would Monday? Yeah, that's, yeah, because uh, Alex does his art uh, yeah, photography, doesn't that he? Yeah, photography Wednesday, Friday. I think then we've got a nice yeah. sort of flavour. Is that okay with you? That's all right. Yeah, mm -hmm. I might so do every other Wednesday. Me, yeah. me, me arms, my joints aren't too good at the moment. <laughs> oh finger joints. So I keep I keep an eye on it, but um, yeah, no, you just right. let us know. Okay. Oh, that's lovely. Yeah, Monday's good. good. So I'm just I'm just adding a little bit of red. It's just to give it a little sort Ooh. of lift. Okay. And is it by adding like colours and it gives it that feel, does it, of, of layers and Yeah, really you build it up. I mean they could be flowers yeah. and things like that. Oh yeah, okay. Like yeah, that. So 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 it's so, up. But this can all be added on later once it's dry if you're not mm. too keen on it. Then if you've got a, another type of brush, I don't know how many people how many brushes people have got. I've got two. I've got two. a one. I've got this <laughs> you is still fine. got two. <laughs> oh, you do very one well like through. Yeah. I've got a makeup brush. Ah, I that's like good. Makeup brush because it's tiny and it, it I can do fine stuff with that, but Oh, uh, brilliant. Mm. Do you go to the club at all, Teresa, or not now? Yeah, I popped on Friday far. to, um, yeah, I had to drop off a few things and collect these bats. Yeah. But I think next I guess... week I'm going to start, yeah, doing some one-to-ones on the outdoor table. Because yeah. if you need more, people. yeah, if you need more brushes, I can give you oh, some. Oh, bless you. Yeah, no, so no. so oh. here I'm just, I'm just uh, using a fan oh, brush, or oh, you can use Serena. tissue. Yeah. Sorry, You're have you got enough? enough? Everyone else got enough brushes and things. Oh, I got yes. too many. I only use a couple. Lucy wanted <laughs> to give some to Wenway, but I think um. I no, think do you know what? I, Lucy, 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 I sent him. I sent him paints and brushes, but I don't know if he just, just doesn't want to join in. I think he's, he's polite to sort of say, yeah. yeah, he wasn't too sure. You, but no. Say no. That's all right. Does the yeah. table tennis need any? I've got tons. Oh bless I you! Oh, I, think I don't think so. Right. Keep them. You might. I won't. Be I won't be doing this up. forever. <laughs> no, exactly. We will get okay. back to normality. Yeah. Right. This is normality. She might be doing lots more art now. Yeah. yeah. Brilliant. That's, That's good. Idea, well, that encourage. Because you've been doing a lot of art, haven't you, Jane and Doreen? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Keep me busy <laughs> lockdown. Yeah, you can unmute yourself if you like. Yeah, Dorian. do unmute yourself, folks, if you want. I'm just oh, that's wonderful. 
Lucy. Wow, that's fantastic. That's my practicing. Ah, that's brilliant. I love the colour combination. There you go, Serena. Oh, to... that's great. Oh, that's nice, amazing. Teresa. Nice colour blending. Now we're going to go for the trees. Okay. So, so get your brush, keep, dry it, make sure it's all really dry. Okay. Clean it and dry it. And what colours are we going to need? Okay, the red. The, that's uh, the red I was going to use. Mm. Is is sort of like autumn-y, so I'm going to go for a bit of yellow and a bit of red. So I can show you first if you like, and just. Okay. Uh, Can you see that? Yeah, I'm just. So I'm just going to dab it on. Okay. Oh, what's that? Then, oh, so you're doing the the florally bit, not the trunk. Yeah, yeah the, the, the 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 leaves. Doing, so I'm, yeah. I'm probably going for autumn. Oh, I see. Oh, the leaves in first, is it? That's really... but it's Can red and it? yellow. You sort of. Mm, okay. Yeah. Yeah. How many trees are you going to do, just so I can get my... Uh, three, but you can do one or two. Oh, is that red and yellow, did you say? Yeah. You can do, do whatever, whatever colour yeah. contrast. Of, no, you can do white blossom. Yeah. You can do pink cherry blossom. Yeah, you can do pink, pink tree. So there's no rules of how many trees you like. It's free I, free. Like, I like all trees. <laughs> Sorry? I like hugging trees. <laughs> oh, good, yeah. The biggest trees I've seen are in America. The sequoia trees. Staff, but they're really, really nice to hug trees. I went to mm. a place, um, oh, what's it called? It's in, in near, well, it's not near, it's in England and it's all full of trees. Amazing. Ah. Where back to England, Lucy, was it? Oh, I don't know. You be, I haven't you been with your garden design course? Not Kew Gardens, Lucy. No, it's a, it's um, got a H in it. Oh, mm. It's very Vegetable. famous. It's very famous. For Halogen, the Halogen Gardens. Isn't it's it? not Hampton Court, is it? No, it's oh. not in Brighton. Hampton Court's not in Brighton. <laughs> no, I'm not bad at my geography. You wouldn't have thought so if I'd been on loads of countries. So, Serena, you've made one of yours slightly. You made them a different shape, haven't you? That middle yeah, one. Yeah, sort of yeah. Like... Now, the reason for that is is to give it a sense of um, yeah, unevenness. So bit... okay. But that's just um, just to give it a sort of feel of all trees all different and that. Yeah, I like that. Mm -hmm. It's amazing. And I'm gonna, once that's dry, I'm going to do some dark because when we do light and shade. It's always the um, bottom is dark, so the sun is always from the top. So to lift those trees out so that they're not flat, mm. I'm just going to add a bit of darkness underneath, just slightly. Oh, okay. So immediately you see the 3D effect. And that's yeah. what, whenever you're painting, the rule is that to make anything 3D, it's light, the lightest colour on top, or where the light's coming, then it's a mid shade, and then it's the dark shade underneath. And all going the same way, the shade going the same way. Amazing. Yeah, and then you just get a dry brush to sort of blend it in. And if you haven't got a great deal of colour, you can use a little bit of dark black or something. Blue. You can, yeah, any colour. So then once that's dry, I would do my a little tiny bit of white to highlight the top part. Oh, so yeah. your dark, dark, mid-range, and then your light, whitish, almost whitish on top. Sorry I disappeared. I had to get my pudding out of the oven. Ah! <laughs> 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 Was it about ah. I was so busy concentrating, Jane, I didn't see you go. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't see you go either. <laughs> That's all right. So where you're dabbing that white, Serena, is that sort of... Okay, the, the white will be... Just clean the brushes. Make sure it's all clean. Mm -hmm. 
it's literally just a teeny bit of white, uh, a teeny bit of white on the brush because you don't want to spoil it too much because it's yeah, quite a small my picture. Blob. <laughs> okay, don't worry, you can wipe it off and just uh, redo the yep. tree. So I'm literally going to just do a few. Mum, do you want to show the table tennis one? Um, I've got to show you the table tennis one. Hold so on. So can you see the white, the little yeah, white? Just yeah, just little tiny white. Just tiny little bits. Oh, so this yeah. is the table tennis one. This is for the table tennis. We do everything. Oh, your pebbles. Oh, they're, oh, good. they're great. Oh, they're great. Aside from I can see that. Fantastic. We've done one for you, Serena. Oh, thank you. So there you can see the difference, how it brings out the, mm. the tree. So light, mid-tone and darkness. Yeah. Mm. That's in all cases. The, the grass is light, mid-tone and dark and the yeah. sky. So that's the rule of, not the rule, but it sort of yeah. helps you mm. develop that a sort of sense of, so it becomes sort of almost... Uh, second nature yeah and then we're going to do our tree trunks so if you've got your thin brush and this or is you can correct. do it in a pen you can do it in a pen or mm -hmm. pencil first to try it out and then you can paint over it later so i get so i get a thin brush so i'll probably make a, a dark purple with the blue the red. It's supposed to be a stone, but no, it, it's all wishy washy. No. I didn't like it. No, I didn't like that. I might do something else later. On. Don't give up, Doreen. <laughs> That's all right. It, is, it, I think you may have used too much water. Do you want to show me what you... No, you to put, um, it's all gone. You've got, given up. Okay. I lost the picture. You oh. lost the picture. Oh. Okay, tap the screen and you can touch the... Um, video. Video. When can I, you see me, Doreen? When I, when I finish it, I'll send it to you, Serena. Okay, Doreen. <laughs> no problem. Nice to see That's you. A, nice to yeah. see you. Nice to see you. Yeah. We do it on paper no. again another time. So how do Painting you do the stone. then? Okay, right. The tree, we're just going to do, it's literally... Gone. Uh, right. I'll do something again, Bryn. Serena. You can still watch, Doreen, if you want. I use the black, is it? <laughs> Serena, okay. yes. I use the black. I'm using a dark black. I'm making the black out of blue, almost a purple. Uh, for the trunk, yeah. Yeah. So it's literally to a, a V, like a Y, and then you just do some sort. Of... Yeah. So it's not jet black then, is it? Yeah. Okay. Would you say that's a bit of purple with black, is it? Yeah. Um, yeah, or or if you've got a black, then just go for the black. That's what I did. I went straight for the black. Yeah. But I did my trunk thick because it keeps dripping, so I keep pushing it down for some reason, the pen. Yeah, it makes blobs with those pens, doesn't it, darling? Yeah, yeah. yeah the, but you the, can they're different the thicknesses. In. You could blend the blobs in. No, I've done mine now. I like the sound of that. Blend but I need tissue and blob it onto the tissue first before I do it. Normally. Yeah, I've got tissue that I'm blobbing onto as well. I forgot to do that, so I thought I'd just lift my mistake. Right. But I've got a lot of how you, how you coping with your tree trunks? Yeah, right. okay. Not, not, quite, not quite as thin as I wanted it to come out. Like that. No, that's all right. Oh, that's great. You can, you can have a thick trunk. Trees, yeah, my are, trees are all different, aren't they? So. They, they can be, yes. So it's what literally just, with oh. the bottom of it, um, Serena? Is it merging into the... Uh, yeah, it just merges in, blends in with the... Because um, there's always shadow at the bottom. 
Of so course, like in, in Susie's you, sky, you know like the sky on the floor and the floor on the sky. <laughs> Forgetting that it's supposed to be the sky. <laughs> <laughs> so that's going to be an interesting one. So, so when, when you're out in the countryside walking, you can study the trees a bit better. I and you can Ooh. see the trunks and that's how. Um, tree, I don't know if anyone's got any trees in their garden. Have they? I've got loads. I've got loads. You've got loads. I've got none. I'm great because uh, I live around the corner from you, Lynn. Then you can... all right. You live near a park. There's lots of trees and there. And you live near me. Elm Grove tree. Elm Grove. And you go to Queen's Park and there's lots of trees there as well. I've I got a favourite there as well. You hug it. I got it. Yeah, I do actually. I do have a favourite. I feel the energy of the tree is really good. Just give it a hug from me. I want <laughs> hug it and study it. <laughs> And paint yeah. it. People study it before they paint it. Some artists. Yeah. A lot of a lot of time when we do art is is a lot of looking and a lot of staring before you want to uh, replicate something. Yeah. It's more uh eight sort of seventy percent looking and forty percent painting. So. It's, it's, Mm. Oh, I've got a piece of that, that's not bad. Yeah, right. good. I'll hold it up, see what you think. Oh, that's good, Teresa. I like it. Yeah, yeah cool. Well. They're a little yeah. bit the shape of my tree. That's all right. What I've done is I go around the edge and tease it. To yeah, tease it out. I don't know if you can see what I'm doing. Mm. Just um, make the tree a bit bigger. Yeah, I think I need to. Yeah, my tree. So I'm doing that. Like if, you, if you look up, if you look, you can see I'm doing that right now. Yeah. So, I, so I'm just expanding the sides. Yeah, got you. And that'll help you. Teresa, you're really good at art. Thank you. Yeah, I, I don't think I am really, but I, I'm, yeah, I'm not appalling. <laughs> no, you said it every bit. I think you are really good more than you realise. Well, mm. it's very kind. Yeah. And you can add some birds in at the end or just pencil them in at, at the end. You can either do couple of people or a dog. <laughs> well that sounds a bit adventurous for me. <laughs> That's yeah. right. I, okay I'll show you how to do two people really simple. I don't know if anyone's got um if you, if you, if you got a pencil I can do it with a pencil. Right. Yeah. To help you if you like. Or birds like I done. Birds, yeah, or just a couple of birds, little V shapes. So where where are you going to put them? Oh, okay. I, I was going to put them there. Okay. So I could do, I'll do it straight onto the. So I'm, I'm just getting a pencil. Yeah. I've got a pencil. You can just um, a couple of circles. Yeah. Like that. Mm. And then the tiny little head. Mm. And then a couple of legs. Having a hike. Hike in the countryside. There you go. Yeah, you that's that, cool. Yeah, I think so if I did that, it might ruin it. <laughs> no, it won't. With a pencil. Or what you can do, you can let it dry and then do your pencil, pencil afterwards and then you can always use a rubber. Hmm. So it's a little oval shape. And then a tiny little head on top, and just almost like stick men. Yeah, all right. Is it worked out? Did you do it in yeah. pencil, Teresa? Oh, that's yeah. good, Teresa. 
That's great. You also have satellite serenas. No, I mean, yeah, I love it. Exactly <laughs> How's yours, Jane? How are you getting on, Jane? I'm just going in there. You're going into it. Yeah, that's good. Don't don't be shy. It's all fun. It's, all, all, it's just the enjoyment. Exactly. Have you only just started to started to paint, Jane? Or yeah, probably about a year. Um, right. Year, you know, oh, okay. Used to do, you know, when you were at school, and I used to love it. So mm. yeah, I've seen it on Facebook. All your art. Yeah, looking so. good. I've got one person in look. <laughs> that's brilliant. That? Hold it up still, close to the camera. Oh, that's yeah. good, Jane. Yeah, this is brilliant. Yeah, what I like to get you to do is to send me a, once you finish later yeah, yeah, on. We do rather than send me a finished yeah picture, and then I'll Photoshop yeah. it onto the Zoom, yeah. the group Zoom. A record of what you've friend, done. He looks lonely. <laughs> ah, or you could put a dog with it. Do you know what? I used to do one person, then when I did my painting, someone said, Can all well, your paintings look a bit lonely? Can you add to put my husband or wife in? <laughs> <laughs> so I had to add another person in. How would you do a dog? A dog, okay. A dog is a bit tricky, but um, I'm going to do it on here. Yeah. So you can see it on better. So a dog is like um, almost like that. Yeah. Okay, and then you can choose which end, so it's like a, a triangle. Uh huh. Have you got a dog? Um, no, Jane? no, not at, not, okay. at, not at the moment. And no. then it's like that, yeah. and then just two legs like that, and then the body okay. that they got the chest, and it go, always goes up towards the tail. Oh, right, yeah. So it's 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 heavy. The, the, the dog would be depending on what size the dog is, and then you just fill out, fill out, fill it out a bit more. Mm. So that's how you do your dog if you want to put a dog in. <laughs> that's an easy way of doing a dog. That's good. Yeah. Yeah, I like that. It teaches me to do dogs instead of robot dogs. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so I can do that again if you want. To see how to, I did it again. You could you can either do it on paper or you could follow. Ooh, so it's amazing. just a, like a big smile, big smile. <laughs> All concentrating. Yeah, I'm doing it on some paper. All <laughs> oh, right, and then you do your little Practice. sort of face, the dog's face. Uh -huh. Oh, that's good, Teresa. Yeah, no. I'm teaching people how to do yeah, a dog. Just... Oh, that's great. Lovely. And then you do the ears, one ear there, one ear there. And then you do the four legs, quite close to the head, because dogs haven't got big necks. Oh, they start looking like a deer. And then you've got your four legs. And then you do the body, sort of going down. And then fill it in. So if you want to put a pooch in, <laughs> you know no one's got a pooch, add the pooch. Sometimes oh, I put brilliant. a dog in. That's really amazing. And I think we're all done. Well, thank That's you, Serena. Key. It's been absolutely amazing again. So perhaps shall each of us send you a picture this time of what we can put it in that uh, group, rather than holding them up. Or do you want us to hold them up? Um, we 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 can hold them up. Then I can just for now, uh, and then you can I can change yeah. the picture. Oh, I love so your colours there, Susie. Oh, uh, you need to take your zoom your background off, uh, Lenora. Okay, hold them steady, and so that they're focused. Oh, great. Hold it more into the camera, Lucy. Sorry, um, I don't know if you can see. Yeah, my right. Fantastic. <laughs> brilliant. That's Some brilliant. Lovely. Brilliant. Some lovely right. stones. And Lenora, hold yours up a bit close. That's it. Oh, hold it steady. Oh, Keep I it steady. Colors. Back a bit. Back a bit. Back a bit. Back a bit, everyone. <laughs> That's it. Uh, hold it still. Susie, you're waving it around. <laughs> I, I <laughs> do one, with, one, one stone at a yeah. time. One stone at a time, Susie. Your other one's. <laughs> That's all right. We get there. 
I like the way you see uh, my arm. Choose your favourites. Okay, done you, you that's it. Got your favourite stain there, Susie. Brilliant. Oh. Thank you very much. Oh, Serena, thank you. That's been brilliant. <laughs> that's great. Oh, good. I'm pleased you uh, enjoyed that. Oh, yes. That's that's great. Oh. Oh. Right, I suppose it's good to see time, Lynn. What's that? You didn't have glitter. Glad you enjoy. Yeah, I've gone to the birds. I've done yours, Lenora. That's great. Yeah. I took a picture of yours. That's Thank great. But you can do that all different colours. You can do it all orange. Yeah. Next time you go on the beach, maybe do yeah. an, an orange one. That's a nice one. Yeah, it's beautiful. White. That's amazing. So then just use household wood varnish or waterproof wood varnish. Yeah. yeah. Not now, not now, not clear now. Not now varnish. Uh, okay. That'll take you a long time. Oh, yeah. poor trees is tired. <laughs> How long did it take us, Mum, to do the clean uh, out on this? About... <laughs> How long did it take me? Yeah. <laughs> a long time. Yeah. Yeah. I might get you trees. To... I'll hold the stone up and then uh... <sighs> see if I can uh... see if I... I have to get you to do a screenshot. Oh, do you want me to That's do your good. thing?